So today is January 1st, 2024, and this is a video I was supposed to make yesterday on the 31st, but I was kind of learning how to play the game that you see in the background here. It was live, but whatever. So I'm doing it today, and uh, that is one of the changes I'm starting off right off the bat, is I'm dropping the intro segment as well as the ending segment in terms of me saying like hello everyone and you know the whole thing at the front of the end i'm dropping those and i'm instead going to just get straight to the point of the video as quickly as possible just to save a little bit of time plus it's a little bit less talking for me and that's preferable for me but anyway happy new year to you all and for 2024 and this video is to reflect on 2023 and, uh, yeah, so, if you're going to ask if, you know, that I'm going to, if this is a preview for a new game that I'm going to be uploading on, I don't know. This video, I guess I'll have to see. I'm not sure which videos I could make even on GTA, but, hey, you never know. But regardless, so, 2023. What can I say about 2023? It was quite an eventful year, to say the least. Um, it had, for me, it had lots of high moments and lots of low moments. Like, it had really, really high moments and really, really low moments. So let's go through last year. And I won't stay here the whole time. I will go out and drive even though there's crazy shit going on outside here. But, uh, you know, that's kind of just the nature of this game, I think. But anyway... Let's uh, let's start off on a drive around, if the volume's not too loud, of 2023. Let's go head on the road. Okay, yeah, there's a bunch of crazy shit going on out here, but we're outside, so we can begin a little a little drive through 2023, as I'm going to call it. There's a bunch of explosions and shit, but it doesn't matter. Let's see, 2023. January. So 2023 started off with a bang with uh, my family and I going on a cruise to start the year. Literally, it was like the second to the fifth or something like that. It was right at the, right at the beginning of, of the, at the time, the new year. And uh, it was in the, uh, it was in the Caribbean. And, uh, and it was, it was fun. It was my first time on Royal Caribbean. And, uh, yeah, so that was, a, that was, I think, the best cruise I've been on. Everything just felt perfect, if that makes sense. Like, I have nothing negative really to say about it at all. So that was a great way to start off the year with the cruise, where we uh, went to uh, Coco Cay, the Royal Caribbean's private island, which was fun. We went to the beach there. Then we went to Nassau in the Bahamas. And we didn't go off the ship, but, hey, you know... <laughs> yeah, and we did that, did, did, some, did some fun activities on the ship, and then, you know, went back home, so 2023 started off strong. Then you had the spring 2023 semester at school, which uh, was the most miserable school semester that I've ever had. Like, it was just not fun at all. Um, it started off okay, but it, the longer it went on, the, the more it deteriorated, I must say. So, yeah, it got worse and worse the longer it went on. And, um, yeah, so that was quite unfortunate that I had to go like that. And I had to go like that, but it's okay. No, it isn't. But, yeah, so it was... The worst, it was just miserable, the uh, the, the whole thing, it, it was just miserable. I wasn't happy at all with, you know, what I was learning, you know, to get the degree for. And uh, that, that lasted for months, so. But in the middle of that time, my hockey team, I don't own them, but, you know, the team that I root for, the Florida Panthers, managed to make the playoffs and go on the most magical run I've ever seen to the Stanley Cup Final. And we won a game in it. We didn't win the cup, unfortunately, but we made it to the finals. 
we made it to the finals, which was unbelievable to start at any moment. But yeah, so my hockey team went on a magical run to the Stanley Cup Finals. And, um, yeah. But again, unfortunately, we did not end up winning at all, which is unfortunate. But it was an unbelievable run. And I have to say, that was probably the happiest moment of my life so far that I can think of. Is when we scored with 4.3 seconds left. Game 4 of the Eastern Conference Final. To go to the Cup Final for the first time since 1996. I was running around the house. I was yelling. Man, I was just so happy. Man, the euphoria was unreal. It was genuinely unreal. And, uh, yeah, then again, I followed up the school thing, which the school thing was absolutely awful. I was miserable. I, you know, I learned that I don't actually like doing coding stuff, at least the hard level stuff. And, uh, yeah, but the good thing about that is it led me to changing schools and degrees over the summer. But before I get to that, there's something else in the summer I got to talk about. That's our, that's our family vacation last year, where we went to Costa Rica. That was the first time I went to a foreign country and stayed there for a length of time, you know, and not just a cruise port for one day, like I had in uh, years past. So that was so that was awesome. That was genuinely amazing to be in a foreign country for a long period of time. It was a week, about a week, but it was fun. It was so cool. It was a great trip. So that's another another high for 2023. Then after that, uh, I finalized changing schools to the school I'm going to now, Bravo College, and changed degrees to, to the one that I'm also going for now, which is film production. So that's a huge plus, plus that came out of the misery of the spring 2023 semester. And uh, of course, at the end of the summer, the next hockey season uh, began as well. The next hockey season began, which is the one that's going on right now. And my Panthers are, out, are doing fantastic so far this season. They're doing amazing. They are one, one of the top teams in the NHL and one of the best teams in the Eastern Conference. So we are good. We are good. Even, yeah, even, okay, it's the game of the end, 2023. But yeah, we are, we are doing fantastic here. We're doing fantastic. So I guess there's another hype for 2023. And um, yeah, also, I forgot something that happened in the spring of 2023 is I started, I got my first job. I started working for the first time at a book warehouse and I like it. I like it. Uh, it's, uh, it's repetitive. It's simple, but hey, I get paid. It's not hard. So hey, I like it quite a bit. It's actually really cool. I'm able to do that. And uh, before I continue, let's head out of here and go into another activity here. And yes, this is live gameplay with the commentary. Alright. It is. But anyway, let's see what is next. We got that. And uh, yeah, so then the fall 2024 semester uh, began, which is the one that ended. And that's when I started the new degree at the new school. Well, new school for me. And uh, I like it a lot. It was very awesome. Although I'm not very happy with the results of one of the two classes that I took. But that wasn't completely on me. So for me, that's another low of 2023. But now that I go over it, there's a lot more highs than lows in 2023. There are. So. Yeah, so... I. And, you know, of course, all of myself on YouTube, which, which was fun for the year. I did videos on several games. Roblox, Minecraft, Full Guys, Dialtown, Baldi. Well, the Baldi, they did the one. Hey, hey, Hearts of Iron 4. Victoria 3, which I did in, in December, which I really liked that video. And it's got 98 views, so it did really well. So I am looking to make more Victoria 3 content in the future. That's definitely a game I want to make videos on. I, I, I definitely want to uh, make videos on Victoria 3. 
That's a cool game. And you know what? Maybe GTA 5 is next on the list. We'll have to see what 2024 brings for that. But anyway, back to 2023. Um, and I did go to a hockey game. Actually, I went to four of the playoff games in 2023. One for every round. Which was pretty amazing, I must say. Like, that was honestly amazing that we were able to do that. Thank you to both my parents for allowing me to do that. Thank you to both my parents for allowing me to, to do that. And, uh, yeah, and I did go to another hockey game uh, in the current season, uh, towards the end of 2023. I think it was, yeah, it was, it was really December. So it was almost a month ago that I went to it, and that was fun. I'm glad we won it. I mean, I always have fun going to the hockey games, even if my team doesn't win. Because I've also loved the sport of hockey as well. Obviously, it's best if my team wins, of course. But, you know, that won't always happen, unfortunately. Well, that's just how sports go. And, um, yeah, is there any more for 2023 I can think of? I mean, again, the YouTube stuff was fun. I concluded two series in December. Well, these basic classic remastered and Hearts of Iron 4 White Finland, which I am very, very glad that I concluded those uh, two series. Because those two were dragging on for quite a while, especially the Baldy one, and I wanted to conclude those properly and not just leave it unconcluded. So, um. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very glad I was able to, uh, to do that able to do that and again i started playing some new games like i said victoria 3 is one here gta 5 i started playing this at the end of december uh, my friend while g actually gifted it to me which is very kind of him to spend the money and decided to get this for me that was very kind of him to, to do that and um yeah actually him and i did quite a well and i did quite a few collabs in 2023 like several several collabs in 2023 so that's uh pretty amazing that's pretty cool i gotta say that uh we were able to do that and uh yeah we were able to to do that again thank him again for giving me uh, gifting me gta 5 so far i mean it's really cool i gotta say but uh i'm still learning that i'm still getting used to the fact that it's more realistic on the controls so like you know instead of most games where when you you know get input when you press a key or something you know like usually in most games uh you know like there, there's an immediate response to the input and this one there's a delayed response and it's on purpose so that i need to uh, get used to but i'm slowly getting used to it and again i am considering making videos on this game it's just that the computer can handle it just fine but yeah, I'm not sure if there's really anything else to talk about 2020. It's not that I can remember that's uh, relevant, I don't think. I think yeah, 2023, I think overall was a good year. What about you? Um, what about all of you? Was 2023 a good year for you? If not, if not, then what would you like to see better in uh, 2024? I've, I have high hopes for 2024. I think 2024 will be a good year. I think it will be. I think 2024 will, will be a good year, I think. I know that some stuff is going to happen, like continuing my degree for the year. There's still the rest of the current hockey, hockey season as well to look forward to. And new games for me to do videos on, like Victoria 3 and... Perhaps GTA 5. That's not the one I'm, I'm considering. But, yeah, so I think that's it for my uh, recap of 2023. And, uh, yeah, th thank you. Thank you all for watching. Have a good day.